Hello LEGO fans and this is my continuation of my review of LEGO set 10236 LEGO Star Wars Ewok Village um, this video is purely for the minifigures um, if you see my previous two videos on this same um, set um, you'll see firstly an unboxing video um, followed by a review of the main set um, and I decided to do the minifigures separately so let's move into them so as you can see they're all lined up here so there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 minifigures um, in total with this set so I'm going to start with this side so this is Wicket you can see there it comes with a Spear printing on his obviously his face. Let me get that to focus in. There you go. Okay, I think most people know how these are assembled. So the actual headpiece comes like that and that's the same for all these Ewoks um, and then you just have a plain brown body and the shorter legs so that's our first one so next one we have is the Ewok Warrior which we can see So this one comes with a bow and arrow, green coloured, again printed on the face. The Ewok Warrior. Next we have T-Bow. Again printing on his face. This one again comes with the spear. Okay. Next one is Chief Chirper. As you can see this one comes with a staff with the feather pieces on top. There. Okay. Next one is low grey. Stuff. And he's got some feather pieces and a tooth of some kind. And he's printing and he's got the skull on his head. That's him. Okay, so next we have is our Scout Trooper. And there are two of these, both exactly the same. Some really good printing on these actually. Really like these ones. Really look on the legs. Some good leg printing in blue. See, they come with a blaster pistol. See, he's got the black head, but if you turn it round, he has actually got face detail. You can see the rear torso there as well. And obviously, if they're not wearing a helmet, then. Obviously, that look, or you could if you wanted to have him like that. So, like I said, we have two of these. So, there's the other one. So, both identical, both with the blaster pistols. Okay, next up, we have 
or Stormtrooper. And again, there are two of these. Again, with the blaster. So the front and rear torso. And again, like the blackhead with the face printed on. Obviously, you can have this facing forward because of his helmet obviously covers his face. I said there are two of these again both are identical so that's our stormtroopers. Next up we have Luke Skywalker there you go that's some good torso printing with his top folded over in front of his torso. Some torso rear printing. You can see the green lightsaber. And you can see he's got a glove on the one hand and nothing on the other. And it is two sided. As we can see. There. That's Luke. Alright, so next up we have Princess Leia. And you see Princess Leia there. With her skirt on and obviously a long dark hair. You see the skirt. You take her hair off. See her front torso printing and her rear torso. And obviously you can see there as well, she does have a two-sided base. So that's Princess Leia. Next up we have Han Solo. As you can see Han Solo there. Comes with a blaster pistol. Rear torso printing, front torso printing, and some leg detail as well. And this one only has the one face. And that is and solo. Next up is. Chewbacca, absolutely in lots and lots of sets. I think this hasn't been updated for a while now. And you can see with his crossbow. And again, this goes together much like the Ewoks, whereas it's just a plain brown body and legs. And then the headpiece is all one piece, the head and torso detail. And that just goes on top of the main torso like so. Chewbacca, next up we have C3PO. So there he is, C3PO. Obviously the gold detail and you can see the cables and wires inside him. Rear two, there's a rear torso printing. And you see there is eyes. That's C3PO. Next we have again another regular shower in many sets. R2-D2 and you can see is printing okay not a lot to say but R2-D2 and finally we have two Rebel Commandos albeit they are different so you can see the first one, 
Look at this front torso printing, comes with a rifle, blaster rifle. Rear torso printing. And the face, and it is only one sided on this particular one. Okay, so that's our first one. And our final minifigure is the other Rebel Commando. You can see this one is different, I'll put them side by side in a second. So, first of all, you've got the blaster rifle. And you see the rear torso printing. And the front torso printing. And the face details, I've just got a different face, different torso. So we'll take his helmet off. This one has one face and two, so he is two-sided um, face detail. So there we go, so just as a reminder, I will bring up So side by side. Focus. There we go. So you can see they are different. Although it says two rebel commandos, which there are, but they are both, as you can see, different faces and different torso detail. And that concludes this that's all the minifigures all 17 minifigures um, for this particular set so please like and comment on this video um, and please also subscribe if you haven't done to, to my channel to um, support me please in what I'm doing um, please also review my other videos linked to this set the Star Wars Ewok Village set number 10236 um, like I said previously, I have done two other videos. Firstly, the unboxing, um, followed by um, the review of the main set, and then finally this video, which is the review of the minifigures, which I decided to do purely because of the size of the set and the amount of minifigures. So the minifigures alone has taken me nearly 13 minutes um, to review. So like I said, please like, subscribe, and comment, and also please share this video, and I will see you in the next one. See ya, cheers.